A stretch of land is going to help Hubbard in a big way after the Rotary donated the parcel to the Eagle Joint Fire District late last week. First News reporter Abigail Cloutier has this story. It is new tonight at 10. The Hubbard Rotary Foundation donated $7,000 to the Eagle Joint Fire District, all to purchase this stretch of land right beside the fire department. What is more important than the health, welfare, and safety of our, of our community? Uh, if this, you know, this can help them uh, grow or to get out of their fire department facilities a little bit easier than, uh, and get somewhere a minute uh, or so earlier, uh, you can't beat that. The department will do a feasibility study on the land eventually to try to figure out the best use for it, but they have a few ideas. The property here for future use is going to be wonderful because of the fact that you'll not only have this access to 616 over here, um, you also have the availability for possibly future use of a building to house the ambulances uh, or maybe even you know the fire units, uh, the fire trucks. Right now, the department can't fit all of its equipment inside the current building. The department is also working towards finding a use for this former barber shop, which has been donated to the EJFD by the Carano family. Over the years, the department has grown from a small volunteer organization to part-time and now has seven full-time firefighters and paramedics plus Chief Ron Stanish. Something Senior Captain John Bisop says wouldn't be possible without the community's ongoing support. I'm so proud of the fact that we have the support from the community and being able to uh, see that we have a need. And then uh, also the people in the department, they're the same way. We, we, we're all brothers. We all stick together and, and we, we are, we're trying to make it better. In Hubbard, Abigail Cloutier, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.